Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new, a brand new. Will they now? Will they now? <laughs> What up, hey, me. me. <laughs> Welcome back to a brand new video, guys. Navy tattoo, tattoo tag, tattoo review. It's been a while. I've I've got a lot of work done since my last tattoo video, so I thought, hey, let's get a full in-depth one. You're about to see me with my shirt off. Just don't stare at the nips too hard. All right, we're gonna get right into the video, right into the tattoo tag. So as you can see now, I've Almost finished this uh, full sleeve. Um, we have the skull inside here. You know, a funny story about this tattoo. Now, I started this, the top part of this half sleeve, when I was living in Japan in Itsugi. The artist's name is uh, Nori. He was actually on the History Channel. I saw him just randomly. I was like, hey, that was my guy. But a pretty like awesome artist. Um, it's Edo Tattoo Shop in Itsugi. He started this whole half sleeve. Um, he did this whole thing. It was a cover-up. So this is a cover-up and this is a cover-up So he did an awesome job because it looks just like an original piece and it wraps all the way around here And then um, this bottom part is done from my homie JJ um, at Huntington Beach tattoo And also he was a gold rush tattoo in Huntington Beach. So what he did is pretty much just like freehanded all of this He took all of this down From my elbow. So he just like combined this, you know, he blended it all in I just freehanded all of this with a sharpie, so it was pretty insane, man. He's like, he's just a sick artist. This is like just completely original, out of his brain, onto my arm. I was like, hey, bro, like I trust you. You know, just do your thing, like come up with something sick. And then he also did my whole chest piece here. So he combined my chest piece with my with this part of my half sleeve. So he blended all this in here, and um, this was already had these two swallows. The two swallows are a navy tattoo. They represent 5,000 nautical miles sailed. So I have one, two, three. I can't have I can't have a couple more swallows. I just you know I don't want to have like them all over the place. I'm not sure where other spots I might get get more swallows, but I have three so far. But um, he basically took this whole he did this whole chest piece. He did this Hanya. This piece is pretty sick. Um, this is almost done. I still have to like get the rest of the background finished. Obviously this isn't complete here. Um, he still has like to fill in the flowers, some of the cherry blossoms. Same thing for my sleeve down here too. You know, like I can color this in. I do want to color in the snake. So that's something I want to do maybe and just do some of the cherry blossoms similar to this. So still have a little work to be done here and here. And then here, uh, Nasuke Te, what? Are you smiling? It's a lie, I'm trying to go hard right. And then we have Nasuke Te Ipsum, uh, which is know thyself. Which is just like, you know, a great quote. Uh, know yourself, right? Just to stick true to your guns. And don't let what other people do or say influence what you really want to do in life, you know? So that's what that means to me. Then we got the rose. This is another sick rose done by JJ. Um, in Huntington Beach, and he did the swallows here. Now this over here represents my time in the Middle East. Um, I went through the Suez Canal, I was in the Persian Gulf for eight months, um, or no, I was in the Persian Gulf for six months total. It was a uh, eight month deployment. And then down here we got, I already showed you the swallow, we got the 10K. This is for 10,000 subscribers, awesome. And then boom, the 25K. This one's my newest one, it's still healing. Um, it's like a little bit, uh, yeah, it's still healing right now. It's the, in the newest one. And then we got, this is just like a dope traditional sword going through the heart. This is a quote from Into the Wild. Favorite movie uh, is from Thoreau. Uh, he says, rather than love, fortune, fairness, fame, fairness, give me truth. So when growing up, I was always known as like Downing Thomas. My family called me Downing Thomas. My middle name's Thomas, so JT. That's where the JT comes from, Justin Thomas. This one established 1884. This is uh, from my family's farm uh, up in Walla Walla, Washington. Uh, 1884 is when the farm was established. My family has like almost a thousand acres of garbanzo beans and wheat. So that's where eventually I'm headed up to the Great North. 
Then we got fiance. We got the fiance tattoo. The boober tattoo. Oh, get out of here. <laughs> but yeah, we have this rose here as well, which is by my guy at Dire Wolf Tattoo Thousand Oaks, which is just a really just awesome traditional rose. And then the horse. This all here, like I said, rep most of this represents my time in the Navy being deployed um, overseas. Italian flag. This is the, Ita yeah, as well, the Italian flag in, in the eye here represents my Italian heritage. Ah, we got the hold fast. You can see hold fast on my toes. And then on the back, you got the fucking, like the wheel and the anchor. We got those. Probably the most painful for sure were the, the feet. My feet tattoo. Those had to be close to the most painful also. Um, yeah, these were easily top two most painful. Along with around the nip, the nip area, very sensitive. And then also in here, like in the, the big chest piece. Yo fam, thank you so much for watching my uh, tattoo tag video. Um, I also, for some plans that I have in the future, I am going to be getting my elbow uh, nautical star on this arm, um, on my elbow soon. And eventually I wanna do a back piece. So definitely a lot more tattoos to come. Um, thank you so much for all the support. They're on the road to 100K. 30K subscribers coming very soon, fire. And I'll see you very soon. Goodbye, peace.